They're separated by a mere 25 miles of paved highway, but for one Friday night out of every year, they couldn't be farther apart. It's red and white versus blue and gold. It's a bear versus a demon. It's Rifle and Glenwood. Good Friday evening, everyone. He's the greatest sportscaster of all time. Ben Scully used to say, pull up a chair. Tonight, we are broadcasting live from Stubler Memorial Field on the campus of Glenwood Springs High School. It's the stage where one of the oldest, most bitter rivalries in the Western Colorado will be renewed as the Glenwood Demons and Rifle Bears face each other on the gridiron. Sliding again, cuts it up the middle, spun around, and no game. He's going to keep, though, it's a handoff to Porter. Porter, and he's in for the end zone. That's in for the touchdown, Glenwood. And it's a counter keeper by Stutzman. From 10 to the 5, he's in the end zone. Touchdown, Rifle. That's what under center. Back to throw. Pressure coat. It's a shovel pass to Warfell. He's got lots of room. Makes a move. He's got the first down and more. He's got a touchdown. Rifle. Boy, that was an unconventional shovel pass. So that's been back to that was a handoff. The late handoff to Warfell. Off he goes to the races. 40, 45, 50, 45, 40, 30, 25, 20. He high steps it. And touchdown. Levi Warfell. Flex Collin in motion. He takes the sweep on it around the left side. Flex Collin with great wheels. That's when under center two in the backfield. Flex Collin goes in motion. They fake the handoff. Back to throw, he's got a man wide open, caught, touchdown Cordova. Yeah! Yes! Back to throw is Heil. Pressure comes, he's going and down. he's going down, he drops the ball. Oh, that's going to be a fumble. That is a fumble, his arm was not going forward. Sweep, no, he fakes the sweep, keeps it around right in, steps it off to the races, he's finally wrestled down inside the 10-yard line. Off the Warfell, breaks tackles, and powers his way forward. Counterplay to oh, Laxcala. To Laxcala, races for it, scampers close to a Bears first down. Pitch play to Laxcala. Has the first down and more. Just quickly up to the line, another quarterback keeper by Stutzman. Getting a little shove from behind by Warfell, no indication yet. Like he went sideways. Oh. Touchdown, rifle. This might be one of the more difficult places to, to, in the Western Slope League to come and win, okay? And I'm proud of you guys. I'm proud of your, how physical you were. We absolutely have to execute better if we want to go the places we want to go. And you also have to do your part in taking care of your bodies. But this is a special, special night. I'm proud of you guys. Come on in here. Glad to have you joining us wherever you are in Rifle Newcastle or along I-70. It's going to be a wonderful evening tonight as Rifle and the Bears get ready for a homecoming game as they welcome in the Coleridge Titans to Bear Stadium. Dustin puts a man in motion. He's got a single back behind him. It's a nice draw play to Levi Warfell. He's past the 50, the 45. He's going to go at the 20, the 15, the 10, the 5. Nobody will touch him. He's into the end zone. Myro's kick is a short one. It's a square that's going to land about the 30. It bounces back towards Rifle, and they got it. It'll be a give to Cordova, who goes inside on the trap block, and he breaks free at the 10 to 5. Will he go? Go back behind him. It's a wing key as well. That goes to number 28 for the Titans. Back in that wing tee. It'll be Warfell up the middle, and he just makes a move and gets behind his blocker and keeps running with two Titans on his back. Load up this near side and then go the opposite way as they roll out, holding Stutzman on the design wall. Finds Levi Warfell. 
who gets it to the five yard line, stiff arms a man, stays on his feet. Is it a touchdown? Yes, it is. Second and five from the 40, it's a box play. It's Jordan Grant. Cox Cloud is in motion from the far near side. If he gets up the north wall, he's got a couple of men on his legs. He breaks free to the 10 to the 5 for the touchdown. Single back Damian Spell in the wing tee. This was a fumble by the Coleridge Titans. Ball still on the ground. It's picked up by Ariel Herrera, who walks into the end zone after the fumble from the Coleridge Titans. And Ariel Herrera still running around with the ball in his hands, mobbed by his teammates. The homecoming vibes flowing. Jordan Grant with Damian Spell behind him. It'll be an option play. Track down quickly by the Rifle Bears. Split out here to the near side. Split backs again. This time it's just the Kenny Clark Scala on that pitch, and he will walk in untouched. And that is a solid victory for the Rifle Bears. They shut out the Coleridge Titans 44 to nothing in a very impressive display of some football acumen. Bears on three, ready? One, two, three! Hey!